Our Minister of Finance, Kwame Imbert, is standing by the Budget Division's choice to award the THA $50 million to cover the costs of the Gulf Stream oil spill. The THA originally requested $153 million, making the allocation provided in the media budget review only a third of the initial request. Chief Secretary Farley Augustine stated earlier this week that the $50 million would not be enough to satisfy the needs of contractors and other people, such as business owners and fishermen, who were negatively affected by the oil spill. However, Imbert insists that the budget division tried to get enough support in documents and met with a team from the THA four times in April to determine what should be allocated. The chief administrator submitted a letter dated April 17th providing some explanation and that formed the basis for the recommendation and it is based on actual invoices being processed for the months of February and March and a small contingency for the future. However, Chief Secretary Farley Augustine refuted such claims, stating that the Ministry of Finance was provided with all the necessary documentation. Meanwhile, Limbert shared the breakdown of what was approved by the Budget Division. The cost of cleanup and remediation, 33.8 million. Lease and rental of infrastructure, 4.8 million. Materials and supplies, 184,000. Catering, 327,000. Marine support services and consultancy, 5.9 million. Security, 196,000. Contingency, 640,000, adding up to $50 million. Augustine also stated earlier this week that despite the allocation not including relief for fishermen, he would try to prioritize a portion for them. This means some contractors might have to wait longer for their compensation. For the outstanding bills, the Chief Secretary mentioned that he would submit the invoices directly to the Minister of Finance.